Hi, Mike Scarberry Parts here, illustrating how the choke works on a Carter YFA one barrel carburetor. And this is the YFA, and when the choke is closed like it is now, you see the fast idle cam is uh, up, and your idle screw will be on the high point of it, and which increases the RPM a little bit, keeps it running. And when the choke gets uh, heated up and the valve opens, that cam will be on the lowest point. Or I should say the screw will be on the lowest point, and that's where you set your idle speed. Okay? So that, that hole right there with the threaded hole, that's your hot air intake. Now this is your... Uh, pull down, choke pull down, and there's a vacuum tube that goes to it. It helps uh, keep that piston down. It also works on pulling the hot air up. If you need to clean it out, there's your plug. Take that plug out, clean it out, and then put a new plug in it. You need to measure the plug and then get on our website. We have them by measurement. So uh, what that does is uh, when the engine is cold and you stomp on the gas, you need that choke valve to open a little bit, and that's what that piston does. It pulls down and opens up that choke valve just slightly and lets more air into the carburetor. Otherwise, it'll die out when you stomp on the gas. So it all works together. So the next thing I'm going to show you here is uh, installing the choke thermostat. Now you've got a hook on the end of your thermostat and in this particular one it hooks onto that little lever in there in the choke housing. And you put it now, put it so that it's up against that and I believe this goes counterclockwise and you want to hold your throttle open. You want to turn that so it closes the choke valve. And uh, this one's a little sticky, but uh, you want to get it to where it just closes that choke valve, okay? And then turn about another eighth inch. And that gets a little bit of, uh, you'll see that's not, that's not enough. See how it stays up? There you go. You need, you need just a little bit. You need to be able to push it just a little bit to open it, okay? And so that's... Uh